Next, on his quest to atone for his sins, Heracles had to capture the Arithmanian boar. As simple as it may sound, the boar was massive, and once it started moving, it was nearly impossible to stop. So Heracles had to use his brain as much as his brawn. This plan came underway when he found the boar and shouted at it, causing it to stir and start before chasing it. And as he chased it, he turned it about a thicket, confusing it and changing its direction, before moving into a field of snow and eventually pushing it to a stop within a snowbank, the beast being slowed, beaten, and battered by the movement. In that moment, as it lay there, Heracles grabbed it and slung it over his left shoulder before returning to Mycenae to give it as a gift to Eurystes as promised. And as he did, throwing it there on the assembly floor, Eurystes was frozen in fear and awe. Heracles had once more done the impossible. More tasks were on the way, but those are a story for a different day.